My father used to be a pastry chef, so there was a lot of cooking going on in my family. But I think that I first started getting into food when I came here because I had to cook my own uh, meals more and I had to feel closer to home. So I started cooking lots of Greek uh, food. So Greek food is very simple, ingredients to speak itself. We don't use much spices, we use mostly fresh herbs and seasonal ingredients. I've started cooking lots of Greek recipes. I, I've started asking, calling my, my grandma and my mom and asking her, oh, how shall I do that? Oh, shall I use that instead of that? And then I was like, okay, I want to cook. So I left my job, I quit my job and I've started cooking. <laughs> I started with pastries because pastries and pies, it's a very big part of Greek cuisine. I'm very much into the traditional kind of cooking and how it should taste, like how a traditional dish should taste, but I would make it a bit more modern. I'm inspired by anything really, art, music, movies, other chefs and uh, food trends. When I started thinking that, you know, I want to have my own project and I want something that people can engage with it, I was like, okay, it has to be simple. Greek food is simple, it's honest. Pan sounds perfect to me. It's a simple word, it's a frying pan. And then in Greek it means everything, all it's inclusive. In, in Spanish, in French, it means bread. So it means something to most of the people. Recently we had a, a catering request and it was for a small family. The father is Greek and he's very ill. And the daughter asked me to cook for him because he's not going to be able to travel back home again. That was, uh, that, that was very touching and very... Uh, I felt like very happy and content after doing that. It was just so intimate and so important for them and for me so I felt very very happy doing that.